Four suspects have been shot dead in Guamashu near the corner of Sikindi and Nandi Drive, north of Durban. The suspects are believed to be linked to a number of cash and transit heists that have been recently been taking place in the area. This week alone, there have been two such heists in north of Durban. Our reporter, Mlondi Khadebe, is joining us for this conversation. Mlondi, good morning. Thank you so much for making time for us. Tell us about what you can see at the scene and what the police have told you so far. Thank you very much, uh, Aldrin. Police are telling us that in this morning when they came to investigate, as they were approaching their house at the corner of Skindi and Queen Nandi Drive, the shooting, uh, basically the men who were inside the house started shooting at the police and then the police re retaliated and police killed four suspects who were inside the house. Police found a gun, uh, basically firearms inside the house. Also, they found explosives. As I'm speaking to you now, I'll just step out of the shot. There are police officers from the explosive unit that are inside the house and they've been appealing to the community members who basically are in, uh, around this area to try and stay away because these explosives, they are not sure whether the explosives will explode because they are not sure of what, what is happening to them. But Aldrin, I will just also uh, remind you that this is one of the busiest road in uh, Kwamashu, in the B section. This in Queen Nandi Drive is the road that comes from the N2 into the Malandela Road. The Malandela Road, there was an incident during the week where the cash and transit heist happened there. And in the early hours of the morning on uh, that day, the Basically, the, also the community members in Guamashu witness that uh, cash and transit is just a stone throw away from where we are. And the police are saying that community members, they must make sure that they report these incidents because for now they they, they, they see, they're seeing this incident as one of community members. They knew about these people because it seems as if their house has been rented out uh, to them. These people are coming outside from, uh, the, outside from this province. Aldrin. Yeah. Um, you spoke about the explosives a bit earlier on. Do we know whether any money was found on the scene and uh, how many people have been injured? At this point in time, the police, they are not uh, talking about the man. They did not say uh, whether they find the money because you remember that the incident that happened during the week, uh, they basically the suspect ran away. And then last night, there was also another incident that happened on the N2 near Queen Nandi Drive where the cash and transit heist, basically the car was bombed or was explosives were used in that car as well so the police they are seeing they are saying that because of the explosives that are inside the house they are still trying to see whether these people are linked to the uh, cash and transit in the province as well as the incident that these people the firearms that were found in possession of these people they might be firearms that belongs to the uh, security guards that were robbed during the week because during the week, three incidents of cash in transit heist happened in the province of KwaZulu Natal, Aldred. Yeah, and any arrests that we know of as yet? There's no arrest so far, and they only uh, basically four people that were basically killed this morning. Okay, no, thank you so much for that update, Mlondi Khatebe, there in uh, Guamashu on an update around the four people who have been killed, suspected cash in transit heist um, uh, as suspects there. And also, you remember that this comes just uh, literally a month after that incident that took place in uh, Pulukwane where you had around 19 suspects um, in, a, rather in Makadu rather, where you had 19 suspects who were gunned down by police and these were also people that were suspected to be part of a cash in transit heist.